What's up? You know, I'm sitting here waiting on some friends to go to the game today and it reminded me of something I saw this morning when I was eating breakfast at Cafe Brazil after a motorcycle ride and I was watching Joel Osteen getting transcribed on the, the screen, right? And he was talking about uh, Mordecai going to war and all this other thing. Is, and I'm not here to talk about religion or any of that. But I started thinking like, man, even since biblical days, people been at war for really nothing. Back then, think of how much earth was around, yet they were fighting each other for a small strip of land. Kind of like what's going on in Gaza today. I'm just saying, right? But, and a lot of that is related till back in the biblical days. But regardless, I started thinking like, what causes people to go to war? Like, what makes people so angry that they want something else? Well, as I show up in Dustin Black from Black Tie Movement's garage, this is not his Ferrari. This is someone else that works here's Ferrari. And uh, he does have a Ferrari, though, by the way, just to be clear on that. And I thought, wow, I really like that car, right? Obviously, you can see it right there. It's a nice car, convertible, spider style, right? And I thought, you know, what would I be willing to do to get a car like that? My friend Dustin has a car like that. He's put himself and his family and everything, extreme sacrifice. And you know what's funny is, like, I have a nice car, too. A silver one right there? That's mine. It's an Infinity. It's a nice car. A lot of people would go to uh, war in the workplace, the marketplace, and be able to get an Infinity. That's what I did. Some people go to the war all in to get a Ferrari. Now, the reason I'm not saying that I haven't gone all in, but well, maybe I haven't, right? But that's not the point. The point is, we always are coveting over what something else has, right? There's more technology in my car that makes it more comfortable, more like better for cruising down the highway for long road trips. There's all sorts of Bluetooth stuff in there, all sorts of gadgets that I don't even use that aren't even in that car. However, when I see it, I want it because fast. So that can't believe me to that led me to believe that it's in our nature as humans to like want what somebody else has. You want other people's girlfriends, you want other people's spouses, you want other people's jobs, you want other people's clothes, you want other people's cars. And we've become civilized over the years where we obviously don't grab axes and blocks of wood and hop on horses and go beat each other to death and crusades and stuff like that for pieces of land. But now what we do as salespeople is we go market against other people. We go take over territories as sales guys. We go get more accounts, escalate up the, the corporate ladder or escalate up the entrepreneurial ladder, which means more money. And that's the war we're at today as a civilized society. So the reason why I say all this is it's not that we're particularly these days going to war with our fists and the guns and stuff like that, even though a lot of people do. Military, God bless them, government, all that other stuff. At the same time, you and I as closers, we go to war in the marketplace every day because we want what other people have. My neighbor, he has a McLaren, a Bentley, a Harley, an Escalade, a Mercedes, and a Ferrari. He goes to war every day. Are you waging war every day? Just asking you a question because it's human nature. And if you're fighting that urge and you don't have stuff, there's your reason. That's my lesson today, everybody. Share it if you dig it.